Alexa, stop playing, please. Thank you. Hi guys, so it is Monday morning and it is a new week, a fresh start as they all say. My apartment is very, very messy. Uh, I don't know, I clean it and then the next day like I like do some stuff and it's messy right away. But it is pretty, it's not early in the morning but it's still, it's still morning time. This morning I woke up, I was meditated, everything like that. And I had a Skype call with one of my 10 week coaching girls. She was amazing. I love having my Skype call with her early on Monday mornings. It's just amazing. And right now I just changed really quickly and me and Stella are actually having a little fun girls day. We basically wanted to do this on Saturday, but we realized like it's so much traffic. We're gonna go to Malibu, we're gonna go to Sun Life, grab a quick smoothie, um, and then we're gonna go to this like little, it's like a little cafe on the beach in Malibu, and they have like cute little drinks and like watermelons and pineapples, and it's literally on the water, like like you, you sit in a chair and your feet touch the water, like the ocean, so it's so beautiful. We wanted to go on Saturday, but there's so much traffic going to Malibu if you live in LA, you know what I mean? Like if you go on a Saturday, it could take like two to three hours. If you go on a normal day, it could be like 30 minutes, so. We're gonna do that, we're gonna Uber because I don't wanna drive. Like I always drive and it's just like I don't wanna be driving today. Um, a little outfit. I'm just like, I was gonna wear a swimsuit, but honestly, like, I don't know if anyone else feels this way. Swimsuits are kind of like uncomfortable. Like, I, it hurts my neck when they like pull on your neck, and then they're kind of like itchy. And I just, I don't know, I didn't want to wear a swimsuit, so I'm just wearing like this top, which is really cropped. It's from Misguided. I'll link it. I'm sorry, my apartment's messy. And some little lemons, and I'm gonna wear like these cute little, uh, platform espadrilles because Stella's taller so we take photos. I hope she won't wear heels today but um, really quick I wanted to go over some stuff. I've been meditating with these five crystals and I just wanted to share. I feel like I don't share. I don't know why I've noticed like I don't really talk about like what crystals I'm meditating with and which ones I like I talk about a lot about spirituality but I feel like I could explain more like I don't go into depth like I don't explain which crystals I've been meditating with and what benefits I've had from them. I don't know why I don't but I just realized I should start. But I've been meditating a lot with blue agate. This is so soothing. It's so relaxing. Really great for communication. I like I like meditating with this every morning because I feel like before I start fully like talking, because I meditate, like I wake up, I shower, I meditate, like before I do anything. So that all my communication comes from a clear and more centered place. And so it's very soothing and calming. So if I wake up a little frazzled, I'm sure if you guys have those mornings where you wake up a little frazzled, it helps with that. I love this one. I meditate with two rose quartz um, in the shape of hearts. I love rose quartz. I like... I find it so, I, I love wearing it every day. I'm gonna wear it today too. It's just, it really harmonizes your energy. I like wearing rose quartz and crystal in bracelet form. And I like wearing it on the left hand to receive and the right hand to put out, it really depends. But super soothing, relaxing. You literally, if you meditate with rose quartz, I'm sure you know what it feels like. Bye. Hello. Um, you just feel so like at ease, at peace, your heart like overflows with love. I'm not kidding, you become so compassionate towards others. It's really great. I feel like to start your day off from like coming from love is so good. Um, then I meditate with a Lumerian seed crystal. This one is a point, which I really, really like. Really good for crystal grids, but I like doing this. I like meditating with this one and I like using it for grid activation. I could talk about that like more, but this one, I feel like if you research Lumerians, there's like a whole... <sighs> Oh, there's so many articles about Lumerian seed crystals. Basically, it's like within the crystal, there's like messages. You can research this deeper. I'm giving you the briefest summary. So when you meditate with it, you get like really crazy clarity. Like I'll meditate with it and I'll just like get a met like this feeling about, about something, a situation, person, whatever, and it feels so right. And it's like whoa, like it's almost like it's just like downloaded into your head. It's almost like beep, like you know it as if you know you're like is that how I know my eyes are blue? Like you know that message is true. So I'm meditating with this a lot. I love this. I picked this one up in Seattle. So beautiful. And lastly, I've been meditating with aquamarine. I've meditated with a lot of calming crystals because I feel like a lot of the times when you're like busy or doing tons of tons of stuff, I can get like easily frazzled or not communicate clearly. Do you know what I'm saying? When you gotta like <laughs> like all over the place. So I've been trying to meditate with a lot of calming crystals, a lot of relaxing crystals, and a lot for like more clear communication. So the other ones I've been meditating with today. For incense today, I burned a rose incense. I really like the smell of rose. I like burning rose incense on Mondays and Fridays. I know it's like very, your probably people are like, huh? But Monday's ruled by the moon, Friday's ruled by Venus. And I don't know, I feel like for some reason those are the two days where I love burning rose incense. Um, and it was really, really nice. Um, the makeup is like the exact same makeup I've talked about in yesterday's vlog. All everything I'm wearing, and oh, uh, what else? What else? That's basically it. It's just gonna be such a fun day. I can't wait to take you guys along. When I get back, I have a spin class tonight, and it's like a hard, it's like an an extended one because it has like a full uh, full arm workout with it. So I'm really excited. I feel like my arm has been getting really toned lately. I don't know. It's been like 
just from like doing the spin. But this one's like an extended class, so I'm really excited for that. And then, um, yeah, it's basically kind of the day. I'm so excited to be outside all day. I feel like so much of the time I'm just like caged up because I'm working. Like yesterday was Sunday, and I was literally like home the entire day until I went to the museum of um, ice cream at night. But like, you know what I mean? I just like feel like there's like the planet is so beautiful, and there's like. The fresh air is so soothing just being in nature is so soothing and put it just grounding your feet on like sand like it literally grounds your energies is so amazing and it's like i'm so like it's like i feel like we take advantage of it like i'm literally sitting in a cement building on this planet like okay you know what i mean like i need to I don't know, just being outside and like fresh water near the the ions near the ocean and just grounding myself and having some 10 ph water they have this brand generosity at Sun Life and having a smoothie and like a little watermelon drink. Like, I don't know, you know, it's fun. It's going to be such a good day. I'm, I'm affirming it now. And I suggest that you guys too in the morning when you wake up, just like set up. Like today is going to be an amazing day filled with love, prosperity, happiness, abundance, reconciliation, joy, love, and whatever you want. And just affirm it. Like, don't even let yourself. I know it may sound, it's something so small, but it'll really start shifting your thought patterns. Like, just do it every day. Affirm, affirm, affirm. And literally within like two to three weeks, you're going to be waking up and you're like, wow, I actually like align with this. Coco like, tries to eat the incense stick. I don't understand why. Um, also, if I look a little paler, I just haven't been getting spray tents. I think I talked about it too. I tried to get a new solution. It really broke my legs out. So I might do like a half body because it didn't break out my top half. So I might do like a half body. I don't know when though because I can't today. But yeah, I love you guys so much and let's go. beverages and that you're extra <laughs> so obviously me and Stella I love, I love balance so I got a cold brew with three pumps of vanilla my pH water and then a green smoothie from Sun Life and then a vegan grilled cheese as a nice little treat oh my god it's kind of hard on um, a nice multi-grain bread what did you get oh my god my lens is a little I just got a nice Brazilian bowl mmm <laughs> And a hydration, don't y'all forget. Cups tumbling to the ground when she speaks. Calabasas local. Calabasas <laughs> local. I love just making a quick drive to Malibu in the morning. Just for a quick, uh, we were talking about how we love the Malibu Country Mart. Like, it's so cute. I'm setting an intention now. So basically, this place, we come. I feel like I've been here so much lately, but Ooh, I got I a, love it. I am a local. I got a little green smoothie. So I got acai bowl. I got a little water. A little Cold brew. I also stopped by Lululemon because I wanted to get a fresh pair of Wonder Unders and I wear the 788. What's the like special wash thing? Oh, you, it's, it's you want to wash them on cold and with nothing that would like like leave like lint stuff on it. Um, but Do you know our policy, our, our washing policy. But what's it called? I wanted a new pair of my 7 8 pants because I've been wearing these a lot and I just want a fresh one. I linked the ones I wear, they're perfect if you're like 5 2, 5 3, like they cut off perfectly. They're called the high time 7 8 length. And then I got a white pair of leggings because I was like, Stella, I wanted a white pair of leggings. And I was like, do it. And she was like, do it. And I was like, you're right. So, got that. We're about to go to this little beach cafe. Why is he? He's been here for so long. Sometimes, sometimes it lags. Oh. Our man. Also, my mom just sent me more bracelets that she finally put out. So I'm wearing, this one's a moonstone. It's so beautiful, so pretty. And then this one is, I think, a black tourmaline with the Z beads. She only had like three of them. They were super limited edition. They're like, you can research what they do. They're like insane. They have like tons of benefits. I'll list like a little thing down below. And then this one is an amethyst with a huge raw amethyst chunk. And like, look at the quality of this amethyst. With the darker the um, color, the better quality it is. And then I don't remember, I don't know what this one is. I think it's literally either, I think it's blue agate. Um, and it's like so soothing and pretty. So these are some of her new bracelets if you guys are interested. And her site will come out on the 23rd. I know because I've been working on it as well. <laughs> yeah, so much. Oh my gosh, my shoe. Do I have time to retie this shoe because it's so painful? Yes, it's two minutes. This two minutes. Okay, y'all, a quick tutorial. But, like, literally, ow. Amazing. I wish the strap was, like, smaller. It's kind of, like, meh. But, um, I was saying, I can't wait to be a mom and live in Malibu and, like, just drop off my kids to lacrosse, go to Soul, go to Soul Cycle, get a green smoothie, go to Sephora, pick up my child. Chad, you're doing great, sweetie. I love my son who wins all the time. What the hell? Where is he? I think it's, like, showing him a weird thing. We are right here, sir. Sir, or even is he? Is he? Is he even on PCH? I don't even know. Um, Miss Stella Ray did not even drink her cold brew. 
Uh, I'm saving it for later. <laughs> also, I didn't even finish my essay. Are you, are you, are you eating? Get you a man who opens you the door. Oh my god. Oh, what a sweet angel. Hello, Paulina. Yeah. Hi, how are you? Hello, how are you? Good, how are you? Hi. Hello. Head to your drop of the Paradise Cove Beach Cafe. Oh, thank gosh. Oh, huh. If we told people we were sisters, you think they'd believe? Yeah, you know, blonde white bitches. <laughs> pretty, pretty, yeah, pretty real. Mm. This place literally has everything. Like urban. Like, like you want a little, you're, when you're a mom and feeling, you want to be a little young and trendy, quick stop. Hey guys, what's cool? Let me know. It's gonna be literally me as long. Be like, let me, what's cool? Crop top? <laughs> okay. Raindrop crop top. <laughs> Title of the vlog Raindrop, Raindrop crop, crop top. top. Wait, look at the dog, she's so poofy. Just ahead, oh, hi! I'm going to bring my dog here. I can't walk him out of the country Oh my gosh. Uh, I can't wait to get a Tika Pomeranian in two years. I'm getting it. Will you come with me when I get it? Of course, yeah. They're very rare, so you have to like look on these websites for like, they're so expensive. I'm with the, like, get ready for her. Mm -hmm. You feel like, yeah, because like they're freshly bred, which is like fucked up. But like, not not if it's a good person, but it's like hard to find one to adopt. I'm gonna try to manifest to adopt one because I want to obviously adopt. I don't want to shop, but like if, if I search for one and I don't find it, then I had have to. But because it's like they're like this big, they're teacup pumped and they don't get bigger. They stay like this big. Are you serious? Yeah, and I'm gonna bring her like all the time in my bag it's and like, like a hamster. yeah. A little hamster, me. I'm gonna bring him to the country, mar country mart when we get this. She thinks it rides on the top of the train. I'm literally getting it as a gift for my college graduation. Right? Such a memorable thing. I'll look back. I oh, got she when I did all that work. Literally, though. Wow. I'm gonna name her Chanel. Because I have Coco and then Chanel. Oh, so good. Or maybe it's actually what like. smaller than Coco. Yeah, I don't even know because, like, or maybe I'll name something else if you have any ideas because, like, because like my cat back home, her name is Chanel, so I don't have two oh, Chanel. No, no. So what should I name? What's like a cute name? I don't know. Mm. I like my, my one of my friends, Allie. Hey, Allie, if you're watching, her dog's name is Bentley. He's so cute. Um, McLaren. <laughs> Jeep. <-Pack. laughs> Mercedes. Mercedes. You know, I like Mercedes. <laughs> what's your what's your puppy name? Mercedes. Mercedes. <laughs> down below if you guys have cute names for like a cute little teacup pomeranian and i choose your name i will literally let you know everyone know that it was you please give me a Hi, I swear to a little cafe in Malibu. It's like pretty sunny and bright, so I'm trying to get a good footage. But we got these cute pine. The pineapples are very slippery and heavy. Yeah, right. Me after a beach day. <laughs> slippery and heavy. Yeah, slippery and heavy. It has a cute little flower. It's so cute, but it's very wet. It's really hard to hold. I honestly was getting so stressed. So Sal tried to take photos of me on the beach with it, and it was in one hand. It was falling out. It was so slippery, but mm. got a nice side of fries. That looks sad. That is an animal. And they look so happy. What, like, if, what if we put a human and, and then fish stood there? Huh. How would you feel? How would you feel? I like it when it's more, a little more shaded. Because when it's sunny, it like burns my eyes. Yeah, it's nice. These fries are really These good. These fries are so good. I was just like, uh, we, we had to order food to like sit up. Yeah, okay, so you literally, like, I'm going to give you a quick Yelp review. It's advertised, oh, such cute drinks and pineapples. First of all, they got rid of the watermelon drink, which was, I was so invested. Right? And then second of all, I think, I saw some mini pineapples over there. Maybe those boba drinks they put in the watermelon. But not vegan. Maybe you could request. Yeah, not vegan. But, um. If you ever want to get a table, so you, so you literally cannot go outdoors with like a drink, like the cute ones. Were you able to post? I did. Mm -hmm. It says I have LTE, but yeah. it's not loading. Nothing beats the naked eye. Nothing beats the LTE. You should make the caption, nothing beats the naked eye. I made the caption for work day. I love that. <laughs> but, so you cannot bring like nice drinks outside. So we had to like order some food to sit outside. Because do we want to sit in the cage? Mother Earth is here, the beach is here, but we're gonna sit in a cage. After we finish this, we're gonna go on the beach a little walk. We'll sit down and yeah. enjoy the scenery. Next week, we should just have a day that we come here and like rent one of those little things and just like lay there all day. No offense. Oh my gosh. Can you get my water? I'm so sorry. Yeah. Mm -mm. In there. Wow, she fits. She fits so much. <laughs> A little well, pH water, it. never hurt nobody. Yeah. I love these fries. What are what's the texture of these fries? They're very, like crispy. They're like very crispy, but like also there's still content like inside. Moist. This ones are yeah, they're moist, crispy, but still have content. I love Sometimes the word I feel moist. I don't. I like panties. I hate that word. Oh yeah. How would you say that? Yeah, why well, it's underwear. Yeah, right. <laughs> they are not my panties. Did I tell you about my potato idea? No, what? 
a restaurant that solely focuses on potatoes, curly fries. They have one of those. Where? I don't know, but I know that they have one. Maybe it's just baked potatoes though. Look, baked potatoes, curly fries, waffle fries, smiley potatoes, crispy potatoes, steak potatoes, um, waffle potatoes, mashed potatoes. Mashed potatoes. And what are those, those like sticks? What are those? The ones that are really thin called? Fries? Like the really thin fries. Those are really thin ones. I don't know. Straw, like straw fries. Oh yeah, straw. I like how some of them are a little stuck together. I'll, I'll me, this is me and you for a long day. <laughs> My Instagram is still sending. I have T-Mobile and I love it. Everyone's like, oh T-Mobile, honey, I always have service. I need to stop talking in that accent. It's like becoming normal. No, right? I'm like, whatever. <laughs> I need to catch up. I'm sorry. I'm gonna get a little, I was a little stressed. I'm just de-stressed. <laughs> me starting my work week. Me just me de-stressing de on Monday. Submitted on the power and you brought me to my knees. Use me. later in the day you're probably like huh um basically Stella and I we hung out and then oh my gosh there was so much traffic coming back from Malibu and normally yeah there's traffic but today it was like Saturday traffic on a Monday and I missed spin like we were supposed to be we left yeah, but like literally I'm not kidding like five o'clock we like we're like oh like an hour max like I don't didn't even say there was that much traffic and then I literally got home so late I got home like two and a half hours later like missed spin which is completely fine like I you know like I've learned I feel like it's been like a lesson to just trust divine timing. I know like I could e easily been like pissed like oh I didn't get my workout in etc cetera, etc cetera. but it's like I don't know I trust it in divine timing in a sense like you know what I mean I never know what could have happened if I did go you know you know what I mean just like I don't know so like I said I'm honestly really exhausted it is I'm not even kidding you it's 8 47 p.m. right now I'm about to go to bed at 9. I know it sounds I just I'm so exhausted last night I was up pretty late pretty late for me it was like 1 a.m. Um, and this morning I woke up early because I had uh, like I said, I had like a console and then I had that I, I mean, still had plans for the day. And yeah, I just postmated some food from, it's called My Vegan Gold from Silver Lake. It's so good if you're in LA. I had your money posting from there. It's a really high quality vegan food. It's just like delicious and flavorful and delicious and just amazing and not greasy and gross. It's just like so good. Very high quality, I'd say. Um, but yeah, I'm doing a face mask. This is the 10 minute Origins Miracle. I always talk about this one. Also, I think I was really dehydrated because I drank like a whole Fiji bottle. Um, but I also wanted to show you what, what I got Lululemon. I just got two pairs of leggings. Like I said, I've, I usually wear the High Time 7 8 pant from Lulu. I literally wear, you, you know them, like I wear my Lululemons every single day. I'm not even exaggerating. That's like the crazy part. And then I have other ones I spit in, but I just decided to get a new fresh black pair. Um, There's just material. Is this the material I even wanted? Hold on a second. Sorry, I like need to. Oh my gosh, this is the material I wanted, but it's fine. Look at the lighting. Like, what is it doing? It's literally, I don't know, but it's okay. So I got the High Times Pants 7 8 length. It's not the material I wanted because, like, the material I want is like the Lux Stream material. It's always sold out online. But whatever, these are fine. I'm not gonna be that mad about it. Um, I just wanted a fresh pair. I'm not gonna be mad about it, right? I'm not gonna be mad about it. The ones I have are like a, like a spandexy material. I love them. They're always sold out online, so I decided to pick these up. I just grabbed them because I assumed that they were the luxury material. I should have looked closer. It's completely fine. These are still nice. These are just the normal ones. Um, they're like just thicker and like they're less um, sporty feeling. These are just cute and nice and comfy. And then I got this pair. I've been wanting. They didn't have them in my size. So I had to give them a size up. Uh, I personally like Lulu's in a two. I like them super tight on me, and they didn't have these in a two, so I got them in a four. But it's totally chill. I feel like they'll be fine. I'm just saying that for reference. I know people are gonna be like, "Oh my god, like you don't need to fucking say your size." Like people ask me, okay, because a lot of people are the similar size as me. But I've never had a pair of white leggings. I think they're so beautiful. This is what they're called, the new tight. I'll link them down below. But like they're very thick, and they're like that. Like I just, dude, Lululemon's so fucking addicting. I want to go on the website right now. It's just like I can't even handle myself. And then like, look how cute. I don't, I don't even know, like, these are so adorable, like, look at these cutouts, I've never had a pair of white leggings, I feel like these are gonna look so fun on, I wanna get the white sports bra from Lulu to wear it together with, like, my rose gold shoes, I know it's, like, so extra, but they're really, it's really, these are really nice, 
I probably I wouldn't wear these to spin. I feel like I'd wear these just to like run errands and stuff because I feel like for spin I'd get sweaty and like if the bike is like has it's like dark leather. Like what if it gets in the crotch? I don't know. You know what I mean? These are pairs of pants I got. I'll link them both down below. But I just thought I'd haul for bed really quick. I'm really tired. I think my I need to like listen to my body. Like I just need to catch up on sleep, and that way I can wake up tomorrow morning at like seven or even like six thirty. Honestly, if I like get enough rest and start my day, I have a really productive day tomorrow. So yeah, that's basically. It. I didn't do my mask evenly today. I usually use like a mask brush. I just kind of use my hands, and it's um, uneven, but it's totally fine. Also, oh, really quick. So I wanted to go over. Did I show? I already went over the new bracelets my mom came out with. Um, this is a Z bead bracelet, a moonstone amethyst highlight. Oh, I am with this with a raw chunk. She can custom make the ones with the raw chunk if you email her, but normally just dark amethyst, and it's really, really good quality amethyst. It's like super dark. Um, this is, I thought it was blue agate, but it's blue chalcedone, adventurine, and then rose quartz. And for uh, on June 23rd, her web, I'm sorry, like I'm going over so many times, but I just keep getting so many tweets being like, how do I order, blah, 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 and I'm trying to communicate what she's telling me to you guys. So if you can order through email, but on June 23rd, her website's launching, so get super excited for that. Um, we both been working on it together and it's amazing. I'm going to order from Sephora my um, Sunday Riley serum. Yeah, sorry, I'm so tired. Like, it's literally 8.51 p.m. and I'm like... <sighs> okay, Sephora. That's basically what's up. I'm really excited about my pink leggings. I mean, my white leggings. Really like them. Like, they're really nice. Real nice. I, you know when you're like, almost like delirious, you're like, I need to go to bed. I also, I look like a, <laughs> I call myself a coconut head, but like guys, like do I not look like a coconut head? <laughs>